isn't the most recognizable athlete in the tri-state area. Have a great game, man. This is the NBA Finals Game 2. The Dallas Mavericks come in off a critical game. The NBA playoffs continue. Just two teams remain. They are battling their way toward this title. Game two of the finals. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony, Hall of Famer Doris Burke, and another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, from the sidelines. Taking a look at Toronto, they've overcome a number of challenges just to get here. Now down one game to none. Greg, they face a huge hurdle. And you know what? I think they learned a lot in game one. Playing against the best the league has to offer. They know they have to make some adjustments. Keep everyone involved, and they have to hit the open shots they're getting. You were talking about the adjustments before. I agree. Let's check out Toronto's starting lineup. Barnes and Siakam will slot in at the small and power forward. Then it's Rob Williams. Then there's Dick. And it's Jim Whitty in at the corner. In with it with the bucket. Boy, Pascal Siakam plays at his own pace, able to find the open man. Here's the pass to T. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. And that's exactly what he's looking for. Draining the triple. Dinwiddie passes to Siakam. Raptors moving the ball around. Barnes gets to Dinwiddie. Wide open, and he can't answer back. The three-pointer off lock. Here's T off the mark with the outside fadeaway. Raptors have gone two or three here to start out the game. Pass to Siakam. Right block shot. It's rebounded by Doncic. Boy, what a job defensively! You couldn't play that any better. Shot from the wings, and he connects with the jumper. T's got five points so far. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. Siaka misses. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. He's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go, baby. It is showtime. Awesome rewind, courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Team. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Barnes can't get it to go. For Dallas, they've gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. T, rebound by the Raptors. Tim Woody outside. This is it to Dick. And the Raptors miss again. Yeah, and they had some boxed coverage that turned into no coverage. And here in the first job, uh, about three minutes in. That one drops for him. Well, the versatility he possesses makes him a very tough cover, guys. Here's Siakam. It's a seven-point spread. So, timeout called here. The first for Toronto. Trying to snap them out of this little slump. Just feels like the basket is looking awfully small to them right now. They're having a hard time getting anything to fall. Let's take this chance now to show you the list of the postseason scoring leaders. Look at T, leading the league in points per game. Such a great play.
Siakam outside. Back to Dinwiddie. Williams scanning the floor. Five to shoot. Siakam. Offensive rebound. Shoots over Doncic. A shot by Williams. No good. Dallas with the ball. Big run right now going for him. 11-2. Okay, see the attention Luka draws. That's why his teammates get so many wide open looks. And so Siakam will bring it up for Toronto. They trail by nine points. to Barnes. Williams a screen on Hardaway. A three from Barnes. It's rebounded by Doncic. Doncic has got four rebounds in this game. Shoots it. Again, the Mavericks score. Building up a big early lead. They have taken charge of this game. And they've been doing it largely at the offensive end. If the defense does not adjust, this could be a blowout. Dinwiddie outside. Siakam outside. Now the pass to Barnes. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Now Pascal Siakam looking aggressive and determined, which forces the defender to commit the foul. Toronto shooting their first free throws here for the night. And the first one at the line is good. Siakam hits them both. I think what's probably surprised me the most about Pascal Siakam is how prepared he is to be the primary scorer for an excellent team in the NBA. This guy has shown no hesitation. And out of bounds as Toronto gains possession. Toronto has possession. Nine point game. Doncic against Dinwiddie. Pass to Barnes. Over Hardaway. And again, Toronto no luck. Here's Dallas. They're on a 15 to 4 run. T shot is good. Oh, great ball movement there. Hunters trail by 11. Now, Dinwiddie. And he makes good on the layup. And they've scored several times already here in the first quarter on the inside. Here's G. And the dunk to finish it off. A beauty. Yeah, they have gone full throttle from the opening tip, showing no signs of letting up. Well, you set the tempo early, and when you get command and control of a game, it's perfect. And Barnes gets double team. And a wide open look for Siakam. Basket is good. The assist from Barnes. Siakam's got five. There's no hesitation in catch and shoot situations for Pascal Siakam. He has turned himself into a legitimate threat. A shot by T, no good. Raptors trail by eight. Dinwiddie is surveying the floor. Pass to Dick. Here's the dish to Barnes. Pocket six. Williams has a screen for Siakam. And Lively pulls it down. And this is a shot he can definitely make, and the defense not a factor at all. And Hardaway gets it to go. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. And so here's Toronto. Dinwiddie with it. Pass to Barnes. Over Hardaway. Barnes can't get it to go. Boy, what a nightmare quarter for this guy. He's playing right into the hands of the defense at this point. And they are shooting the lights out from distance here early. Here's Dinwiddie. And the pass to Siakam. Here's Barnes. And again, no good by Toronto. They've been sensational on the backboard to start this game. Here's T. A three-pointer off the mark. 
Raptors trail by 14. Dick passes to Dinwiddie. And Siakin has it in the corner. Shot clock at five. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Siakam's got seven points. Boy, as that shot clock starts to dwindle, you cannot get rushed. Pascal Siakam, so, so comfortable. To the right side. Here's T. Oh! You got to be kidding. And he goes in for the dunk. They've been excellent so far, coming in with a well-balanced attack on the offensive end it feels like they're getting the shots they want and defensively they are connected and on a string. Dinwiddie passes to Dick. And Lively pulls it down. Lively's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Here's Prosper. Traps in the tray. And the Mavericks lead by 17. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. And the Raptors call time here. And some changes here for the Raptors. Carter, he's checked in for Barnes. Dennis Schroeder comes in for Tech. And Tyus Jones subbed in for Dinwiddie. Williams finds Siakam. Pass to Schroeder. With the drive. And that one drops. And this is Schroeder's game, right? Get off the dribble drive with a quick first step. Nice. Here's T. He's guarded by Schroeder. There's the screen. Hardy passes to T. It's rebounded by Schroeder. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on him. Passes it to Siakam. Schroeder surveying the floor. Shot clock at six. To the middle. Here's Williams. It's tipped. Here's T. He's guarded by Schroeder. He is such a great dunker. Greg, a high riser, no doubt about it. And so it's Jones. He'll bring it up for the Toronto Raptors. Trailing by 17. They double him with Irving. Here's Schroeder. Off target from outside. Dallas has gone 4-7 from three-point range so far in the first. Here's T. Oh, and he jams it right over Pascal Siakam. Wow! put on a show for these fans. I can't believe he pulled that one out in the course of an actual game. There's Siakam. Seven points in the game. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Schroeder outside. And the Raptors miss again. Mavericks leading by 19. And again, it goes in for him. Good shot from T. T's got 28. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Takes it out to Siakam. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Siakam's got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for the Raptors. Here's T. Defended by Carter. And it drops once again. The bucket from T. T's got 30 points. You can just see the passion and love with which he plays the game. You see how he prepares, the work ethic, the way he interacts with his teammates. And when he hits the floor, it's all about the game. Here's Carter. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Clearly a foul. Raptors have gone two for two in the game at the line. Two shots. And 
and that one misses. Maxi Kleba, he's checked in for Dallas. Luka Doncic comes in for Hardy. And the second free throw, good. There's 45 seconds left to play here in the first. Here's T. The reverse jam, unbelievable. And not only does he get all the way to the rim in traffic, but how about he goes to the reverse? You gotta be kidding me. That was awesome. Shoot from 12. Jones, no luck. Mavericks leading by 21. There's the steal. Carter looking around. Pass to Tillman. Jones against Doncic. Carter outside. Three-pointer. A shot off that time. And the buzzer sounds to end the first, and we've got a blowout underway here. The Mavericks on top, opening up a huge gap. We're back after this from American Airlines Center. time for more of the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. What a time of year. And quite a position here for the Mavericks to be in. What do you think, guys? Well, when you control the glass, you control the second chance opportunities on both ends. And that's how they controlled the first quarter. I thought they were the much more physical team. T is out there with Doncic. And it's Kyrie Irving. And there's Jackson. And it's Livers in at the four. So that's who Dallas starts the second with. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Yeah, David, it's all yours. Take it away. Well, guys, T in that last outing against the Raptors got the job done. He scored an amazing number of points and a triple-double for all that effort. The level he played at in that one was incredible. Now, he always wants to play his best against their rivals and, to say the least, mission accomplished. Guys? Yeah, David in stretches. He was absolutely done. Great. He loved to match that performance tonight. This team needs his contributions. When he's right, he makes winning plays time and time again. Well, when you're coming off a game like he had, you know the difference tonight. They're going to load up against him. They're going to try to take him out of his rhythm early. Six to shoot. Here's Jones. Here's Pirtle. And the dunk by Pirtle. I think his frame makes him very difficult to deal with as a role man. Pirtle can set a mean screen. Here's T. Started by Schroeder, and he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. First team foul. First team All right, we'll take a look now at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Dallas. And guys, I love the movement. Doing a great job of just getting the ball on a string, creating some opportunities. And the other thing that's working for them tonight, getting out into the open floor, a lot of the damage coming in transition. Jones against Doncic. Jones looking for an opening. Here's Pirtle. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Jones has got his third assist on the night. Boy, getting his points the hard way. Jakob has to absorb contact and able to use his strength there. And can you always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass? Money. Schroeder dishes to Jones. Here's the three. And the Raptors hit again from deep. Well, after three hitting points. zero from distance in the first, that's his second make this quarter. Here's T. He gets that one. T's got 40 points. Well, I absolutely love the way this guy has controlled the pace tonight. They've been able to play the style they want. The pass to Tillman. Kicks to Jones. 
Knocks it loose. Here's the break. Here's T. Right through the D for the layup. T's got 10 points in the quarter. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. Doncic against Jones. Nice D from Doncic. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Jones kicks to Barnes. There's a screen. Pass to Tillman. Here's Schroeder. Connects from three-point range. Schroeder's got 11. And he's really shot the ball well, but, but it hasn't been contagious. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. And now, let's give you a look at the players who have stood out and taking high percentage shots in the playoffs. Look at T, leading the league. Jones, the pass to Dinwiddie. And they're on the break. And I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen tonight. Just simply being outplayed both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into easy points. Siakam outside. Passes to Dick. Six on the shot clock. Siaka, right side. Got a piece of it. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Mavericks leading by 23. Here's T. What an incredible scoring display he has put on tonight. And that one is good. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Now, here's Siakam. In the corner, it's Dinwiddie. And again, Toronto no luck. Here's Dallas. Nine points in a row. Good run for him right now. Here's T. He got it again. Sensational. My goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. Toronto calls timeout. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Keep pushing, fellas. Well, poor rotations, poor Keep communication. Pushing. There's a lot to figure out right now. Side, Jones, Toronto working the ball around now, and it's in there. Dinwiddie's got his third basket of the night. That was big because they dug a big hole in the first quarter, but starting to show signs of life. Here's T. And good! There's another. And he's up to 52 points. Yeah, making a GA look all too easy right now. Jones kicks to Siaka. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Prosper's got oh, the power on that through down. Goodness. That's what we call a power finish. There's no such thing as gentle for the big man. Siakam deciding where to go with it. 
And it's off from three-point range. And so it's Irving with it, bringing it up for Dallas. Their offense came out big in Saturday's game. And, you know, they played a terrific all-around game. The effort level was there as well as the production. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it was hard to imagine them being much better at the offensive end. They were so efficient in almost every aspect. Siakam passes to Dick. Now here's Dinwiddie from 13. And it's T with the rebound. Pressured that shot by getting the hand up just as good as a block. And he did it without fouling, and that's become an art. Changing shots without making contact. Getting it done on both ends, and it shows up in the score. Well, what I love is the energy they're bringing right now. They're ignoring the scoreboard and playing hard. Jones dishes to Williams. It's blocked, and that's out of bounds. Toronto will retain possession. Doncic is checked in for Dallas. The Raptors also with a sub. Scotty Barnes, he's checked in for Jones. Barnes against Hardaway. Tim Woody for three. Rebounded by Prosper. Prosper's got rebound number five here tonight. I think he's got to settle down because right now it feels like he's rushing, like he's forcing some shots. This quarter he has been completely bothered. And here are the Raptors now. Barnes outside. Pass to Williams. Jake with it. They need this. Mavericks with the rebound. Ivory's got nine rebounds now tonight. Here's T. Another three for Dallas. They are trying to close this out strong, and he's the man who's put you in this position. 125 left now here on the second. And T is going to pick up the five. That's his first foul. And right now, let's watch that terrific swat. Well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now their defense is in overdrive. Siakam kicks to Williams. And there's the pass to Barnes. Shot clock at six. Dick sets a screen for Barnes. Drives to the hoop just doesn't seem to have it here in the second quarter. No good. Still playing with the cold hand. Makes him just one for eight. Here's T. Oh! oh he is a highlight reel unto himself, guys. Uh, that could be a contender for the dunk of the year, I think. It's been a pretty tough stretch for them. And this will be an important possession. It's really essential. They put a stop to this run, and the best way to do it is by great execution. Tim Woody against Doncic. Here now is Tim Woody. Toronto shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. At the line for the Raptors. No good on the free throw. He hits the second from the line. 36 seconds left to play here in the half. Pass to Prosper. Here's T. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Scotty Barnes picks one up. Yeah, just nice strength there, and then just off with the shot. The Mavericks shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. He does a great job of drawing contact and getting himself to the line, something he didn't do in the first period. Yeah, nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. Siakam outside. And Witty for three, and the last second attempt does not go in for him. And so it's Dallas with a major 39-point lead here at the end of the quarter. And with as many three-pointers as they've drained, it's easy to see why they're on the cusp of a blowout. And don't go away. We'll be right back.
Jim, we thank you for joining this postseason broadcast, and it's been an outstanding first half for the Dallas Mavericks. Well, you see they've caught fire with their shooting, and a big part of that is his shot selection, getting the right guys in the right spots. You've done your job then. Yeah, they're beating up that defense, moving them around, having them look like scrambled eggs with cheese and waffles. Mmm, making me hungry. Taking a look at how the series is going for the Raptors. Their chance in this final series starting to slip away. Not how they wanted to start this game, Kenny. Your thoughts? Well, you know, some panic creeping in, not going right, and um, they have a tough road in front of them. Tough is an understatement. Their road has been hit by hail, mudslide, even an avalanche. It's all bad for them right now. Man, can they find a way? And that's all for us. Now it's time to send it back to Kevin Harlan for the beginning of the third quarter. as we get going here in game two. Really an incredible game from T. Yeah, and with all the pressure he must have felt coming into this one, it didn't phase him one bit. Fantastic start. Boy, he has been locked in, all about business, just going out there and doing what he does best. Setting the floor for the Raptors. Barnes and Siakam will slot in at the small and power forward. Then there's Dick. Then it's Williams. And it's Dinwiddie in at the point. And Williams throws it down. So explosive around the basket. Williams, when the pass is on target, expect him to finish with the rim wrap. They set the pick. Crafty move. Pass to Prosper. Launches a three. Drills it from outside. 68 points for T. Williams, a screen on Doncic. Kicks it out to Siakam. Passes it to Barnes. Good ball movement here by the Raptors. Here's Dick. That one falls coming off Dinwiddie's feet. Dinwiddie's got three assists tonight. Not just a jump shooter. Dick can operate inside that restricted area. T the pass to Hardaway. Another three for Dallas. Yeah, that's two bombs in a row from long range. After shooting just 39% from the field, struggling to find that net. Doncic against Dinwiddie. Here's Siakam. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Prosper's got six rebounds now in the game. And yet another basket. And that's 70. He's unbelievable. He's the leading scorer tonight, being aggressive, and so far, no one's found a way to slow him down. Dinwiddie outside. Barnes outside. Back to Dinwiddie. Williams a screen on Doncic. Dinwiddie for three. Takes it out to Siakam. No good with the triple. I'll tell you, this guy is doing absolutely everything he can to get himself going, but the team is struggling because he's struggling. A lot to like about the way they're playing right now, but still plenty of time left. You do like that the offense is humming along. They're putting in the effort to distance themselves. Picked them clean. Here's T. Stop scoring machine here. And he's good on the three ball. Yeah, this looks like a pregame shoot around with all the threes they're allowed. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Here's Siakam. And just miss after miss right now. Boy, you can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. It's just been one of those games, and they need to find a way to turn it around before it gets completely away from them. And everything is dropping for them. Terrific second half run. 
and I think it's been all about their offensive efficiency, shooting the lights out in this quarter. And Toronto turns it over again. And on the screen now is the 2K leaderboard with a rundown of this postseason's assist leaders. A look at T, one of the best passers in the NBA, always looking to get his teammates involved. And it seems like he's taking it on his shoulders to get every one of his teammates involved in the offense here in the postseason. What a passing display. First personal foul. The Mavericks have split their free throws right down the middle so far. They're two for two. That free throw good from T. Both shots good from the strike. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Nobody near Barnes. And the Raptors miss again. I'll tell you, this has not been his game. And he's making it worse with shot selection like that. Pass to Doncic. Down low. T. And down it goes. Jamming that one home. Boy, you have to be impressed with the offensive production. They have got it firing on all cylinders. And at this point, it is their game to lose. They've done such a good job building the lead. Here's Dinwiddie. And again, no good by Toronto. And the well is running dry for him right now. Nothing falling. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. And so it's Dinwiddie who brings up the ball for the Toronto Raptors. He kicks to Barnes. The pass to Siakam. Can they get it? And he gets the bucket. Siakam's got 12 points in the game. Now this guy continues to build his offensive skill set. Pascal Siakam with the mid-range jumper. Williams comes with a double team. Here's T. What an incredible scoring display he has put on tonight. I'll tell you, right now, these guys cannot be stopped. Boy, it looks like their confidence is at an all-time high, just feeding off each other right now. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Mavericks. You love how they've lived in the paint, making the defense just consistently have to collapse and still finding ways to convert. I think another thing that's striking here tonight, the ball movement is incredible. Again and again, they're making smart passes to ready shooters. He gets it in there. He's got five. You get the sense Scotty Barnes is very comfortable in the painted area. That's easy work. Here's T. And that one is hammer home. Coming into the game, is it fair to say he's hotter? And here are the Raptors now. Now, Siakam. He's got 12. Down to five on the shot clock. It's deflected. Here's Dick. It's rebounded by Doncic. Well, terrific defense. They obviously respect his ability and just want to make it tough. T's shot is good. Well, they're leading in large part because of the work he's put in in this quarter. This is nicely done. Toronto's getting blank from three-point land so far in the third. Still 0 for 3. Siakam outside. Pass to Dick. Right side, Williams. Dinwiddie for three. It's good. Great play by Williams to set it up. Dinwiddie's got ten. Such a reliable threat from range. You'd think the defense might key on him a little bit more. That one good for two. I'll tell you, this guy is proving to be a problem for the defense. In this quarter, he has been special. Barnes kicks to Williams. Watch outside. On the wing, Barnes. Guarded by Hardaway. Siakam up top. And it's T with the rebound. 
T's got rebound number five here tonight. This guy cannot get started, and the offense overall has been a struggle because of it. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. Here he comes, and there he goes. Oh, look at him punish that rim. Awesome display of athleticism captured by your AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Siakam with it. 12 points for him. To the wing on the left. Barnes outside. Some nice ball movement here by the Raptors. Williams sets a screen for Dinwiddie. Trains the 19-footer. Dinwiddie's got five points now this quarter. Dallas has gotten the three ball working for them in the second half. They've hit three out of three shots from long range. Here's T. Out to Hardaway. Over in the corner, Donchich. Another three for Dallas. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. Passes to Dick. It's up a three. It's blocked. And so it looks like the Raptors will retain possession here. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Here's Jones. Nothing on the board. Clock is at three. And it's good for two. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. He has not missed a shot in this quarter. They've tried burning different things in him, but he's been unstoppable. Siakam up top. Jones finds Dinwiddie. Takes it out to Siakam. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Well, with that six foot nine length, right? Siakam uses those long limbs to create contact, get himself some free throws. Nicely done. Some changes for Toronto. Tillman's checked in, and Dennis Schroeder subbed in for Dinwiddie. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. Here's T. Non-stop scoring machine here. Irving for three. Another three for Dallas. And this is the game plan for him. And he's a big part of their floor spacing. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team. Productive and efficient. Jones against Doncic. Jones, the pass to Pirtle. Goes back up, and he lays it up and in. Pirtle's got 10. This team loves it when Pirtle can make an impact on the offensive glass. There's a lot of ways he can get his points, but this is an easy one. Well, overall, they're the team getting the better looks here in this second half. And I think what's happening is they're getting their shots within the flow of their offense, and you can clearly see the difference. Jones, no luck. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Here's T. Makes it off the glass. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. Outside, Jones. Pass to Tillman. Now here's Schroeder. D right on him. And Jackson with the block. Here are this postseason's dead eye shooters. These guys have knocked down a ton of shots from downtown. You look at T, he's absolutely deadly from outside. And of course, Luka Doncic right on the trail. And the bright lights of these playoffs have done wonders for each of their three point shooting. 
That's what they were both hoping for. Scotty Barnes, he's checked in for Pascal Siakam. And a wide open look for Irving. Another three for Dallas. Well, what a monster night for Kyrie Irving playing at a very high level right now. Jones against Doncic. Feeds it to Barnes. Schroeder outside. Basket is good. The assist from Barnes. Barnes has got three assists now in this one. Here's T. He's guarded by Schroeder. Here's T. And another one falls. And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. Hurdle with a screen on Doncic. Jones the pass to Purdy. Here's Tillman. Back to Pirtle. Second chance shot. It's good from Schroeder on the assist by Pirtle. 16 points for Dennis Schroeder. Well, I do like seeing Schroeder get to the mid-range because that shot's still an important one in today's NBA. And so it's Dallas holding an unbelievable lead as the quarter wraps up. Their defense has been terrific in this game. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. Let's go back to a terrific pass that we're calling tonight our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to permit that basket. Well, that's what a great pass will do, right? You love the unselfish play. He's checked in for Dallas. T comes in for Doncic. Dinwiddie against Irving. They double-team Siakam. Dinwiddie wide open. And a miss there on the triple. The Mavericks have gone 5 of 7 from the field since the beginning of the fourth. Strong work at that end of the floor. Isaiah Jackson out there with Hamadou Diallo. Then it's Kyrie Irving. Then there's Harden. And it's T in a shooting guard. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Diallo against Siakam. The pass to Dinwiddie. Williams, a screen on Irving. Just four to shoot. Here's Dinwiddie over Irving. Some solid defense there from Irving. Dallas has gotten off to a great start from three-point range in the final quarter. They're a perfect three of three. Sinks the three-pointer. Boy, well, picking up where he left off. His second from distance this half. Five overall. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Dinwiddie passes to Barnes. And Barnes gets double team. Siakam for three. And it's T with the rebound. T's got eight rebounds in this game. Puts it up. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. And this offense is in a perfect rhythm. And you can see how they're finishing their play. Well, what great game planning. What great execution. It doesn't get much better than this. Pass to Dick. Passes it to Williams. Toronto working the ball around now. For three, Siakam. And it's T with the rebound. Sometimes you just have an off day, and this is one of those games for him. Jacks up a three. Another three for Dallas. Three triples in the first half, three in the second. Boy, do they add up. And so Siakam will bring it up for Toronto. Ball's not loose. Here's the break. 
shot good by Diallo. Diallo's got four points this quarter. Well, they've won the battle of transition buckets, and those easy points have helped them build this lead. Well, this is their pace. This is exactly how they want to play. A little fast, a little loose. Dick. And they get it. The Mavericks pull it in. Great contest by the defender. That's a dunk you've got to put down in his face. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. No, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for. Consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Barnes gets to Dinwiddie. Barnes sets a screen for Dinwiddie. Back to Barnes. Two on one as they jump out on the break. Here's T. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. And you can see now they're starting to push the tempo to good effect. Rano shooting 40% in the fourth. Dinwiddie again serving. Here's Barnes. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That one on Hardy. Boy, the defense tight inside, but Barnes just persevering. First one falls for him. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. And even though they're down, they are putting on a show at the free throw line. Here's T. Another three for Dallas. And I love the tenacity, guys. He simply can will his way into games at times and exert his presence. Here's Siakam. From 13 feet, it goes down. Now, this is such a critical component to Siakam's game. The face-up ability, nicely done on the jump shot. The T shot is good. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. Dinwiddie against Irving. Dinwiddie passes to Dick. Lock at six. That's the three fly. A three-pointer is right on target. Well, that's his second three of the game. One in the first half, one here. Here's T. Again, what an avalanche! He's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. You get the sense he just can't miss. Siakam up top. He's guarded by Diallo. Pass to Barnes. To the inside. Kicks it out to Siakam. There's the pass to Dick. There's the three. And it's T with the rebound. T's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. He takes it in. My goodness, that was absolutely filthy. Oh, nasty. This building is stunned. He dug deep, Greg, into his bag of tricks there. Toronto shooting 40% from the field. Dinwiddie finds Siakam. Two minutes remaining. A block shot on the way. Yep, that one goes in there. Siakam's got four points now in the quarter. Well, high percentage shots are always at a premium. Pascal Siakam gets a great look there. Another bucket. Wow. You see how easily he's getting buckets. To be this high must be a heck of a field. No doubt. And get this, he's now tied for the third most points in a playoff game ever. Pass to Dick. Inside. Here's Barnes. And that one, good. And so many different ways Dick gets the ball to his teammates, always on time and on target. Here's T. Driving good. He hits again. And he now owns third place for most points in a playoff game. An incredible game, no doubt. Nothing can slow him down. 
and that'll effectively take care of game two here in the NBA Finals. We'll be switching venues for the next one, but right now, an important win for Dallas. You don't see this kind of a blowout often, but tonight, this is a quality win across the board to deliver out uh, this kind of punishment. They definitely never changed the approach. I mean, they just kept after it and showed they were clearly the better team in just about every single category. They couldn't have asked for a better start to the NBA Finals. Once they close this win out, they'll be sitting on a pretty good 2-0 series lead. Yeah, and obviously that's the perfect position to be in. They don't need to do anything differently in the next couple of games if they just continue to play their brand of basketball and don't get distracted. They'll be lifting that trophy in a few days. And we watched one guy all night long, guys, and look at the stats just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for T. Well, I think his contribution clearly came at the defensive end, right? He came up with a bunch of huge steals. He was a menace all And again! And he's now claimed the second most points ever in a playoff game. Boy, he is really taking advantage of the defense. Nobody's been able to contain him. Dinwiddie dishes to Barnes. Back to Dinwiddie. And again, unable to change momentum here. Here's T. There's the triple. And it falls. Just a humongous fourth quarter for him, especially from long range. Just in a groove now, and that tray has been deadly. So we see the Mavericks taking the win here. And this win puts them squarely in the driver's seat in the series. Up now, Greg, two zip with all the momentum on their side. I mean, in fantastic shape right now. If they can capitalize on this victory and win game three, you can just about put this series to bed. You got it. That concludes That's game two of the it. NBA Finals. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long, everyone. Stage, my boy MP keeps winning.